How's it going guys? It's Gorilla Man here back to another car mechanic sim video. In today's video, I have finally got a Mach 1 Ford Mustang. Uh it's a 70 it's a 1970 Ford Mustang Mach 1. This just says Mustang at the top, but it's it's definitely a Mach 1. Uh this isn't the DLC. This is the mod version, but since the DLC came out, they updated the mod. And let me show you this. The mod now comes with all of the Ford uh uh, blocks and everything it's it's really really sick this one has a v8 ford cobra jet 429 don't know it very well uh but that's what i'm gonna i'm gonna keep it in there not too much horsepower 375 but i'm thinking i think we stick with it you see uh, i did find this in a junkyard by the way that's why the conditions are pretty pretty high generally above 50 almost everything for the parts which is not great but uh, everything else is looking pretty good i bought it for 49k so i'm not too upset about that but as i do uh first things first let's get to the car wash i want to see how good of condition this paint is in uh, i know the interior is going to be trash but let's see what we got pretty sure it's a uh, nice blue you know that's really not it's not too bad Boss 429 emblem on there. Maybe it's not a Mach 1, but... But dang, it does look pretty good. I, I'm trying to decide if we keep this color or not. I'll probably just fix the body panels and everything, and then we'll switch up the color. That body gap is not good right there. Uh, let me get the inside cleaned out. What should it look like on the inside? Ooh, here we sit in some, this seat. Not bad. I do like it. Very simple. Yeah, hop out real quick. Uh, while I got it here, I'm gonna pop out these seats. Wildcat seat and a roulette steering wheel. Okay, keep that in mind. Let's grab this. Wildcat. Ooh, not wild backslash. Wildcat, and which build did I have? I, I completely forgot. I do like steering wheel 13. Steering, let's, go, let's go 7. I think 7 looks pretty good. Oh, the roulette was the roulette. Roulette. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll stick with this one. That one's fine. All righty. It into place now what's the value be oh that didn't really change that much but the inside is now good to go all right shift you right on back to car lift a awesome love to see it uh i'm gonna get the motor dropped out next i want to get that bad boy out so i can I can get preparations done for the next one. And I'm going to be doing the same motor. Uh, I don't really... Uh, I don't really want to change it. I kind of just want to restore this thing and give it a bit more power. There's like... There was nothing in that one. No oil came out of that. One. Two. Two, three, four. All right. Transmission looks almost brand new. The transmission was definitely replaced at one time. The paint on the block is also still pretty good. Fifty-seven, not bad. All right, I got everything detached, and I should be good to pop that guy right on out. Yes, there we go. Me missing I'm uh, missing like everything else in the in the in the engine bay. Wow, there is zero tread left on these tires. I'm gonna get these guys off. And I can go from the rim Atlantas now to the Mach 1 rims, so they look pretty much the exact same. Uh, except for we got a Mustang logo on them. 
and I'll probably also do the uh, the vintage racing tire as well. Yeah, but how, how, how these look? What's the what's the size? Was it equal? 225, 60, 15. Okay, okay. So we just do Ford. Mustang, there we go. So I got the original and the GT rims. The GT rims are way better than the original, but this is what I was referring to. 15s, four of them. Uh, I'm gonna give them a 10 offset, break them out a little bit, and then it was 265, 225 by 60. 225 by 60. Vintage race tires. Mm. Do this one. 225 by 60. Four of these. Awesome. Get those mounted and balanced. It does just have... Yeah, it's the chrome with the uh, more matte black inlay, I think is what it is. I think it's like a, a matte black. So I was trying to look at the uh, the tread. I want to see if there's actually visible tread on this. There is visible tread, but there's no, no difference between the new ones and the old ones. One. Two. One, two. And there are my wheels and tires ready to go. Let's get the body stripped down. Get all the old parts off it. Oh, there was a there's a clamshell part on there that didn't even didn't even see. Wow, this thing. There's a lot of parts you can take off on this. You got the louve louvers. This window. Oh wow, you can you can absolutely tear this thing apart. Oh man, that. The front half has like 10 parts in it. All right. Does that take it down to zero there? 8%. So there's still something in here. There it is. Engine cover. Uh, repair tip parts. Okay. Yeah. We're going to repair this stuff while I'm here. Oh, there goes the starter. Right, uh, body. So I'm gonna try and repair all this stuff because a lot of this is very specific for this build. So I wanna try and keep everything I can. Looks like everything's pretty much at a 100% repair chance for that. Looks like I'm even salvaging some lights, which is really, really nice. Alrighty, so it looks like I need to get not too much out of everything I pulled. I was able to repair everything that is except for the windows except for the windows that is really nice though uh community car body shop wait is that 1669 i think i have the 70 but uh window with the louvers rear window body window a b okay this, give me this. Um, I think we have chrome, so I'll do chrome. Yeah, it does look like we have chrome. If 
I save a windshield? I did not. Wind. Uh, front windshields? Uh, I really don't know which one to choose on this. Let's go whatever the black one is here. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, that fits, that fits pretty well. So I need a front end. Oh, well, this is going to be interesting. Front clamshell E. Clamshell E only. Lights L-O. Okay, I think I'm on the right one. We'll go with this chrome one. Maybe. We'll find out. Ah, yes. All right. That did work. Nice, nice. Uh, I want to get this engine crane out of my way. Looking good. Trunk. Do I have everything for the rear? Bumper. Tail light with... Tail lights come with... Ah, I see. I'm with the uh, exhaust pipes. Uh, let's get some plates. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? I think they were California plates again. Hmm. Let's go. Nuna foot. That one looks crazy. Let's go to North Dakota, you know, it looks pretty, North Dakota plate looks really cool. Move this crane back to its original position. And what do we look like now? Body 90%, what am I missing? Car part three. Oh, that's right. Part one. Oh, now how am I looking? 96. I'm still missing one thing. So, car part. Control wash reservoir. So, car part three, which has got to be an interior one, right? One would think. That needs to be fixed. Not a bottom trim slot or anything like that. Uh, it's going to be a sneaky one. I know it. Oh, that is a very expensive to repair this thing. All right, get out of there. Hmm. Not 100% sure where that was going to be, but yeah, it's fine. I'll figure it out later. I'll find it. I'll tear apart the uh, car a little bit more. Now we're going to upgrade the brakes though while, while I'm here. Brakes, muffler. Okay, yeah, all this stuff has got to be, uh, has got to be taken out. Okay, yeah, this is just a leaf spring in the front. Double wishbone shock absorber. Okay, yeah, nothing, nothing special. Just gotta tear all those out, fix them up with new ones. Uh, I'm running at what price? So the, the Cobra Jet, a little bit negative on profit right now, but I'm probably gonna end up profiting like 100k from this. I'm thinking, and I think we'll have a carburetor, so we should be able to tune it up a bit. It's a four barrel barrel carb, I believe, so we'll have four different ones we can upgrade. So and we'll get all the way up to 12% increase in horsepower just off of tuning alone but we're gonna end the video there guys because i got a lot of work to continue on this thing i'm gonna get the suspension done and then next episode i'll see you guys with the motor and or the engine i should say 
and we'll get the rest of it all done maybe apply a new coat of paint on this uh leave a comment in the comment section down below let me know do you guys like this color keep in mind the body panels do need to be repainted but do you like this color or there's also there's a ton of color variants there's a ton of, i do like this like this yellow orange like not banana but i like that kind of color there's a ton of stuff to do there's a ton of libraries i think you can slot into this there is a lot of customization to do but leave a comment down below and i'll pick one of you guys who comment the color uh like i did with the bronco and i'll decide for that so uh let me know what you guys think and i'll i'll pick but thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next car mechanic simulator video Take a trailer.